Queridos alunos, a fim de mantermos o decreto e continuarmos o seu desenvolvimento na língua, a gente vai disponibilizar para vocês em formato digital as videoaulas com o intuito de continuar a nossa missão e de principalmente intensificar o seu projeto, o seu desejo, sua vontade de aprender o idioma inglês. Então, vamos lá! Hello guys, how are you? Today, March 28th, we're going to talk about Lady Gaga. The text about Lady Gaga talks about her, talks about her accomplishments as a singer and also as an actress. All right? So if you when you read the text, you will see all this information. Here we have some verbs from it. The verbs to be, to know, to achieve, to record, to perform, to play, to study, to appear, to suffer, and to receive. Okay? Checking home practice. That is on page 818. On the first exercise, you have to answer some questions and using conditionals. So here we have some suggestions of answers, but it will depend on your opinions, all right? So for number one, if I'm not busy at the weekend, I will go to the cinema. Number two, I would call the cops if I found a stranger in my bedroom. Number three, I will listen to Anita if I finish the test in 15 minutes. Number four, if I hadn't decided to study English, I would have studied German. Good? Letter B. You had to get some verbs from the video, so you could get all of the verbs that you could listen. For example, are, going, talk, was, start, have, sell, comment, release, dance, and win. And on letter C, you had to use these verbs to make conditional sentences. For example, if I sing, everybody stops talking. If Sheila Mello releases água, it will be a huge success. If I had money, I would dance on the moon. If I had commented about Lady Gaga, I would have influenced many people. And she will like the gift if I buy it now. And the letter C, and for the senior mass exercise, not letter C, sorry, you had to answer a question. Who would you like to be if you could be another person? For example, I would like to be Katy Perry, because she has a guileless spirit. Alright, so let's go to our review. Our class today is about conditionals. So, we're going to talk about four types of conditionals. Starting with the zero conditional. What is the idea of the zero conditional? The zero conditional talks about things that are always true. The conditions are always real. We usually use zero conditional to talk about scientific facts because they are something that, are, that is always true. So, for example, if Gaga suffers an accident, an accident, her fans cry a lot. So what is the structure? If I'm using a zero condition, I will always have if plus simple present and on the other side of the conditional simple present again. Alright? The other type, so let me just put it here, so something that is always true. The first condition talks about possible situations, okay? So situations that are real, that are likely to happen. For example, Julio, that's not me, will get crazy if Britney Spears re 
receives an Oscar. What is our structure? For the first conditional, we will always have if simple present and on the other side we will have here will may can or to be going to all right for the second condition We're going to use it to talk about situations that are hypothetical, that are unlikely. They are not impossible, but the probability is not very high. So they are hypothetical. They are unlikely situations. For example, I can say, if Mateus were not in the USA, uh, he would appear at repose lip sync number. What is our structure for the second condition? We will always have if plus simple past and on the other side we're going to have would, could or might. Very good. And to sum up the third Conditional. You see, zero, always possible, always real. First, possible. Second, hypothetical. Third, impossible. Because now, on the third, we're talking about things that happened in the past. So they can't be changed. So, impossible to happen. Things that are impossible to change. For example, Creosa would, let me just get more space here, so we can write, Creosa would have studied and Carolina's history if she had not answered the call. So, what is our structure here? We will have if plus Past perfect, past perfect, and here on the other side, we're going to have would plus actually what can study it would plus a perfect infinitive. All right. So these are the conditions, zero, first, second, and third. If you still have any doubts, talk to your teachers, ask, find them on WhatsApp, and talk to them, and now you're able to do the class practice activities. All right, thank you, and see you next class.